Hey, welcome back to Sister Circle Live. It is time now for full, full oh Lord, have full mercy. Circle, full yes, circle. Yes, it is. It is a full circle. Yes, cool. yes it is. Mm -hmm. That's what we talk about. What's on our minds? And today we're reflecting on our experience yesterday when mm -hmm. we looked into our African ancestry. Yes. Mm -hmm. and if you didn't see the show yesterday, we got the results of a DNA test we took through our friends at AfricanAncestry.com. Yes, <laughs> Which, may I add, has the <laughs> largest African American database, hands down, yeah, across, across the, world. the board, yes. across the world. They yes. do. Yes, yes, yes. yeah, I know. Yes. I want to say that. Absolutely, it was a great experience, and uh, Miss Kiana Dancy is going to kick us off and give us more of her backstory and where, where exactly are you from? Okay, so the good people tell me <laughs> the good people. that I'm from two um, groups of people, the Balanti people mm -hmm. and the Guinea Bissai mm -hmm. and the Medindi, Menindi mm -hmm. living in Sierra Leone. Nice. So I actually thought that was really cool. I hadn't had time to research it, but I mean, I'm not mad about it. I think I'm very excited to get into it. Yes, mm -hmm. I want to go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, Kiana, you got very mm -hmm. emotional. I did. What were you What were you going through when she was telling you that? Like, what was happening? First of all, it was like celebrating finding self mm -hmm. because there's so many voids and so many questions that I have about who I am and where I am from in mm -hmm. reference to my ancestors. Um, I will also tell you that. It was just like a, having a, so many things that she told us about the people, it makes sense about, you know, to, of, in reference to who I am. Mm -hmm. um, it was just very rewarding, and I was just grateful for her and this opportunity. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, now, what we need to do also is get the good man, Mr. Gates, down here. Who's Gates? Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. So he can do all the research yeah. mm -hmm. from the, uh, you know, the public broadcasting uh, channel. Yeah. He'll come down and sit down and open he gets, up the book. He gets oh, very yeah, detailed. Gets, right. Now, he she took busy. us all the way back to the motherland. Mm -hmm. I want to know what happened here on stateside. Mm -hmm. um, but I want to say thank you so much. She gave us all a gift. Yes. Um, and this here um, actually magnifies or actually notes where I was born. The countries, well, not where I was born, right. but my people come from. The country she has here Beautiful. in blue and green. And I just want to say thank you. I really appreciate That's this pretty, gift. Yeah, yeah, it's very nice of her. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, very, very nice. Yeah. Well, it's time for me to speak. Uh -huh, yes, uh -huh, uh -huh. Uh, but I... Uh, <laughs> this is so silly. But it was, it was a great experience mm -hmm. yesterday, and I, I had noted this before, that I did do something that, that was very similar to, to this, but not as good mm -hmm. as this. The one I did before definitely told me that I was... It gave me the percentage, mm -hmm. uh, which led me to, to know that I'm 90% Sub-Saharan West African, nice. right? But then when we did the African Ancestry, mm -hmm. we went a little bit deeper and they told me that I'm from Nigeria. Yes, my ma'am. people hail from Nigeria. Uh, and Ooh, my God, that's just gorgeous. gorgeous. Oh, oh, girl, you see, that's how I'm so pretty, right? <laughs> <laughs> that's really why, right, you know. Right. But, but, but she ah. said the people were uh, Yoruba people, Yoruba people, and Yoruba, I'm sorry. Yoruba. Yoruba. Yep. Yoruba. Let me co pronounce that correctly. Yoruba yeah. mm -hmm. and Hausa. So they are very spiritual people mm -hmm. and they are people who are um, business oriented. Yeah, That's mm -hmm. what she said to me. Mm -hmm. So uh, when I think back at who I am, Come I on, say, man. yeah, I'm very in tune with the good Lord. Uh, I believe and I feel vibrations. And um, yes, I'm all about that business. Yes, yes. you are. <laughs> yes, you are all about that business. <laughs> so, so I'm eager to plan plan my trip. I'm hoping mm -hmm. it can be uh, the next trip that I take. I would love to take it and plan it for Nigeria and, and Lagos mm -hmm. and to do some things there. Well, I have a trip yeah. on, the, on, on the calendar if I can get away from Sister Circle. Um, I got my the people keep bidding to get away right. for a second. <laughs> for a second. The people just my, want to get away for a second. My <laughs> God baby is Nigerian and they want us to want me to come in January. You yeah. should join me. January. Yeah. 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 You want to go, go with someone who is a native mm -hmm. and who's also royalty. Mm -hmm. yeah. Shout out to Olabumi Olabode. Hello. Nice. Okay. Oh, yes. 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 Olabode. Yes. <laughs> awesome. Well, like Kiana, I am from uh, Guinea-Bissau, uh, and, and I've heard Guinea-Bissau and Guinea-Bissau the way it's pronounced uh, in West Africa, and I am part of the Fulani tribe or Fulani women. Mm -hmm. um, and I'd love to do a little bit more research. Now, if I were not, my people were not taken from that area, I would mainly speak Portuguese. I would probably be a Muslim woman. Mm -hmm. uh, 20 to 25 million of Fulani people, uh, one of the largest ethnic groups in the Sahel and West Africa. And I looked up what Fulani women do. They follow mm -hmm. a code of behavior known as Pulaku, which consists of qualities of patience, mm -hmm. self-control, discipline, mm -hmm. prudence, modesty, respect for others, uh, wisdom, and forethought respect for others, including 
foes. Y'all yeah. know that about me. Come on, uh, research. Yes. Courage and hard work. And mm -hmm. so if I'm anything like where I'm from, yeah. mm -hmm. this speaks to who I am. Yes. Yes. And, um, hands down. Yes, absolutely. All of these things. And I was like, oh, yeah, that's me. Right. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> me. So I just love it. I love staring at the pictures of Fulani women because mm -hmm. I see my cheekbones in those mm -hmm. women and I see my nose in those women mm -hmm. and I see myself in those mm -hmm. women because mm -hmm. I am a Fulani woman. Come on. Yeah. Now, let me ask you this, Rashawn Ali. Mm -hmm. Okay, because your name is already giving yeah, me a full line of teeth. Yes, right. it is. <laughs> that is. <laughs> yeah, a teeth. Full line full line. Like you already knew that you yes. was a Falani when you was yes. named. Right. Yes. Um, <laughs> do you think that, do you think that, I mean, because you speak of being, you know, taken and mm -hmm. how that has, act, I mean, obviously adulterated mm -hmm. our culture. Yeah, absolutely. But do you think that um, it has kind of uh, swayed you away from some of these characteristics mm -hmm. or kind of hindered you from kind of, uh, adapting to these characteristics that you talked about. Mm -hmm. Like, cause some of them are very true to you, right. like, just when you read them off, right. but some of them not. Do you think that is because we were brought uh, to America? Well, you know, that, uh, that's so deep. Um, but I you know, think... I go, I yeah, go, you know, I go, go deep up under the table. Right here, yeah. on the table. Um, <laughs> well, I really think a lot of who we are, we just don't know. Mm -hmm. And, and it, it really was, for a lot of us, um, was it, it was taken from us, so mm -hmm. we don't know we don't know who to uh, who do we relate to. We don't know how we celebrate in death, mm -hmm. how we celebrate in life, and all of those mm -hmm. things. You got to do your research. So yeah. I want to, I do want to be these things, but I'm glad that I'm some of these things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which definitely uh, um, gives you gives me the 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 what's the word I'm looking for. Um, oh. um, yes. It makes me know that I am yeah, truly who it validates. They, they validates. Yeah. Yeah. Word, Cause right. sometimes it doesn't come natural. Right. Okay. It's all good. Yeah. Thank That's you, right. sister. That's I got, got y'all. Come on, Lena, what you got? Yes. Well, uh, the good people said that I am from <laughs> Central African okay. Republic. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. They said it was a very unique finding mm -hmm. when they went down to the DNA and did a swabbing. Mm -hmm. Now, she said that I was from the Biaka people. Mm-hmm. They look very colorful. I do have on an orange dress today. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if that's part of it. They're holding hands, and mm -hmm. they look very, they, they look like they like each other. So right. I'm a, a person that likes each, like people. Right. So, you know. But one of the things that she did say that um, was interesting to me was that they use song as a form of, you know, uh, communication mm -hmm. and as, you know, just something that is culturally prominent inside mm -hmm. of that tribe and that they use their voices. Mm -hmm. So I, I like that. I think that was awesome. But what it also makes me want to do is to go deeper on yes. the other parts of who I am because th yeah. that was my mother's side and that's not even, singing is not really on that side. Mm -hmm. So imagine what my father's side is. Yeah. And he's the singer and all of his you know, people are sing. So it makes me want to go even deeper, deeper. on my father's yeah. side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But again, we're so grateful for uh, the opportunity to find out yes. what we have found out. And yes. thanks to our friends at AfricanAncestry.com mm -hmm. if yes. you'd like to feel like we are feeling today. Yay. Send us your thoughts at Sister Circle TV on all of our social platforms. <laughs>